Why did Apollo 12 Command Module Pilot Dick Gordon sign this poster for me with the inscription, No Sandwich? I'm Amy Shearer Title, and today on Vintage Space, we're talking about the sandwiches Apollo 12 astronauts took to the moon 45 years ago today. Over the years, I've learned that when you're in a position to meet someone incredible like an astronaut who went to the moon, it's good to come at them with a very pointed question. And in some cases, the stranger the better, that way you'll stand out from the crowd. When I met Apollo 12 Command Module Dick Gordon, I had the perfect, bizarre question to ask him. A few years ago, I found this picture of what looks like a suit technician putting a sandwich in Apollo 12 Commander Pete Conrad's leg pocket. The image comes from NASA and it's dated November 14th of 1969, the day that Apollo 12 launched the moon. But it has absolutely no additional information about this sandwich, so I asked Dick Gordon about it. Dick Gordon confirmed that yes, the Apollo 12 crew did basically take packed lunches on their way to the moon, and added that ham was Conrad's favorite type of sandwich. Gordon also recalled that there was a loaf of bread on board Apollo 12, bread that went moldy super fast in the pure oxygen environment. Al Bean was also there, the mission's lunar module pilot, and he remembered the sandwiches too, but denied the existence of a loaf of bread. I'm still looking for evidence of that one. And now, more than two years after that initial conversation about sandwiches with the surviving Apollo 12 crew, I finally found evidence of the sandwiches in the mission transcript. A little over five hours into the mission, Apollo 12 was on its way to the moon, and the crew had already retrieved the lunar module from its stored position inside the S-4B upper stage. With a brief break, they settled down for a quick bite. It was Al Bean who called down to Capcom, Jerry Carr, I stickered at those ham sandwiches this morning, but I take it all back. Their delicious are compliments to the chef. It makes sense that they would have had something quick and easy to eat on hand. There are all kinds of fun stories about the Apollo 12 mission, and I will be live tweeting the flight starting this morning at 11.22 Eastern Time. Follow me as AST Vintage Space on Twitter for the updates, and I will warn you now there will be a lot of updates, including little vignettes like the sandwich story. In the meantime, head over to Vintage Space over on Popular Science and check out the latest post for some Apollo 12 launch day stories, including the infamous SCE to Ox call. And let me know in the comments below, if you had to take one sandwich to the moon, what kind would you take? And as always, don't forget to subscribe so you never miss a Vintage Space video update.